and welcome to My Pilates Online. I am Linda and this is your chair bar class with me. Thank you so much for joining. Make sure that you have your towel or a little cushion for under your knee and make sure that your chair is securely placed and on your mat. So today we're going to start off by lying down on our backs. So lie down onto your back. Place your heels on top of the chair. Reach your arms down next to your sides. Keep your heels with the arms down. And slowly we're going to lift our pelvis up into the sky, rolling up. And then you're going to bring yourself all the way back down through your spine. So pushing down with your heels, roll all the way up. Squeeze your booty, get it engaged. And then push down through your hands as you roll down through your spine. Breathing in. Breathing out, tuck your bum in and roll your pelvis all the way up. Breathe in and breathing out, peel down. We're going to do three more of these. Make sure that your chair is moving, that your shoulders are released and not tight. And breathe out, exhale, roll all the way down. Now tonight's class really is going to challenge your coordination, your movement, how we work, breathe in. And breathe out, bring your pelvis all the way down. Last one, inhale. Exhale, tuck your back in, roll your pelvis all the way up to the top and hold it there. Make sure your ribs aren't flaring, just those glutes are squeezing. Good. And from there we go a little squeeze, release. Squeeze, release. Squeeze, release. Squeeze and the intensity of this is a lot more than a normal pelvic curl as we're getting those hamstrings and glutes firing because your feet are a little bit higher than usual. Good. Take a deep breath in and then slowly roll down through your spine. Good. And gently from there interlace your hands behind the back of your head. Take a deep breath in. We do a little chest lift up and down. And lift and low. Lift, exhale, inhale, down. Remember the chair class is a little bit faster than your normal average Pilates class. So we're getting a little bit more speed, a bit more cardiovascular work. Chest lift up and down. Four more. Lift, low. Three, low. Two, lower. Last one. Stay up. Rotate to the left. We pulse. Eight, seven, six, five. Keep your pelvis still. Four, three. Two, pause, one to the right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Come back to center. Reach your arms forward. Take a deep breath in. And then open your legs, pop them around the chair. Breathing in. We're going to pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two and one grab behind the back of your thighs roll yourself all the way up and bring yourself up into a standing position just to get your little core firing all right so you're going to start with the open part of the chair facing you put your hands on top of the chair with stretched arm your hands are under your shoulders and your feet are together and closed you're going to rise and lower and rise and lower. Make sure that your tummy muscles are drawing in, you're not hugging in your lower back. And of course, throughout the class, we want our shoulders drawing back and down. We go and up and down. And lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift four more. We go and rise, lower, rise, lower. Last two lift, and then you're going to stay up on your toes, hold it there, bend your right knee and down. Up. Down, up, down. Bending the knee, lifting up with your energy, pushing up through your toes. We go. Lift. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Last one. Eight. Rise up on your toes. Stretch your knees. We're going to go bend and bend and straighten and straighten. So your bum dips down towards your heels and you're going to listen to your knees and your thigh strength. All right, really feel into your body, drop into feeling. Where can you go? Where can you take this? Stretch and stretch. Down, down, and push. And if you want to do this with flat feet, you can do this with flat feet too. Good. 
and stretch. Two more. Down, down, extend, extend. Last one. Down and down, extend and stop. From here, you're going to step your left leg, reach into the back. You're going to do a little lift, lift, bend, and down. We go lift with a straight leg, bend your knee in, put your foot down. Stretch your leg to the back. You want to keep your hips square as you reach your leg up in two stages, and then bring the knee in and foot flat. Reach back, reach, bend in, and lower. Reach back, please make sure your shoulders are drawing down and then you've got a lovely energy of lengthening your spine today last one reach reach bring it in at the side we go long leg reaches back bend the knee foot down long leg reaches back bend the knee foot down three extend remember we are keeping the hips nice and square in a parallel position making sure that you get into the glutes and the hamstring reach reach bend and lower two more reach reach bend and lower last one reach reach bend and lower lower your heels little less up and down two and down three and four and five, six, seven, hold it up for eight. Bend and stretch. Bend and stretch. Three, stretch. Let your chest lift. Four more. We go. And four, extend. Three, extend. Two more. Yes, that's good. Last one. Very nice. Left leg. We go. Reach, bend, foot down. Other side. Reach. Bend, we call this retiro, so it's arabesque, retiro, foot down, arabesque, retiro, double up with speed. Reach in lower, reach in lower, reach in lower. Good, keep going, keep firing up your glutes. Four, three, two, last one, and take it down. Take a lovely deep breath in. I'm just going to make sure that everybody is silent, sorry. And there we go. All right, beautiful work. So from here, make sure that you've got your little cushioning and pop this underneath your knee, your right knee. You want your right elbow on top of the chair, your left hand holding around the chair, and your left leg is reaching along in line with your hip. We're going to lift the leg up and lower the leg down. Lift the leg up, exhale, inhale, lower down. Lift the leg up for three. Lower your leg down, lift your leg up for four. Now we're going to take a little add on. So we go lift, bend, stretch, and down. Lift, bend, straighten, lower. Three, try not to lean too far over to your right while you're doing this. Four, bend, stretch, we add on. Lift, bend, reach for the back, bend, reach for the side, bend. Reach for the back, bend. And the whole purpose here is you're trying to keep your thigh high in the sky. You want to get that knee as high as you can and really work deeply into your glutes. Four more. Reach, bend, extend, in. Three more. Reach, bend, extend. Good. Two more. Extend. And back behind you. Last one. Reach. Good. Now keep your leg at the back. We're going to pulse. Eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one. We go. Tap, lift. Two, lift. Three, lift. Try really lift up through your shoulders and your chest. Yeah, we got four more to go. Very nice. Reach. So we're really getting deep into the booty. Last one. Good. And bend your knee. Pull it in. Reach it out to the side. Lower your leg down and in. Well done. Move your little towel over to the other side. It's lower your left elbow, stretch your right leg out to the side. Take a deep breath in, you're going to lift the leg up and down. Up and down. Two and lower. Three, lower. Four, remember add the bend of the knee. Lift, bend, stretch, lower. Two, bend, extend, lower. Lift, three, good work. Bend, extend, Lower and four, bend, extend, very nice, four more, lift, bend, extend, lower. That's it, so keep working the heart to the leg, no matter how much your buttocks is burning, you can get through this 
this, it's temporary burn. Last one, bend, stretch, we go. Lift, bend, stretch your leg to the back, bend your knee in to the side, bend, back, and then we go. Three, bend, back, and then. Four, bend, reach back, and then. Five, good, keep it the high in the sky, you're looking good. Six, very nice, stretch, lovely, two more, seven, bend, extend, bring it in, and eight, bend, stretch, good, repulse, eight, seven, six, shoulders down, five, four, three, two, straight down and up, we go down and lift, two, and lift, three, and lift, four, and lift, four more, down, reach, good, very nice, good, last two, and last one, finish it off, bend your knee in, stretch your leg to the side, lower your leg down, and bring your knee back on, tuck your toes under, we're going to push off the chair, push your body back through your arms, bend your knees, bend, bend, stretch, hold, and press your body through your arms as we stretch out that torso. Bend, bend and stretch. Very nice, two more. Bend, bend and stretch. Last one. Bend, bend and stretch. Beautiful. Gently bend your knees, walk your feet back towards your chair, and well done. Take your little towel, pop it on top of your chair, walk around, and from here, you're going to place your right knee onto the chair. Your hand is going to hold the back of the chair and then the bottom side of the chair. You're going to slowly just look behind you, make sure you're not kicking anything as you reach your leg up. And then you're going to lower your leg down and you're going to take this knee, lift it up, and you're going to kick it forward and bring it in and back down. So hand to chair, lift the leg up behind you, lower the leg down, and then kick your leg forward as your arm reaches back. So we go knee, leg extends an arabesque, lower, leg reaches. Knee, extend an arabesque, lower, and reach. Now when you lift your leg in arabesque, you really want to bring your breastbone high in the sky. You don't want to let your upper body do this collapsing over here. You want to work your back muscles behind you so we're turning into the waistline and working there. Keeping your chest lifted. Keeping your lovely lats drawing down. We've got two more to go. Bring it in. Reach. Good. Hand. Leg goes up. Bring it down. In. Reach back. Good. And hold your leg up there. That's it. Beautiful. And extend your leg. From here, walk across. Around. Take the same leg that you're stepping up and step your right foot up onto the top. Where you're going to push up and tap. Up and tap. So you're going straight up and straight up. If you feel comfortable, you can let your hands go off the chair. So you're feeling that strength from your quadricep to do the lift. Good. Two more. Reach. And last one. And take it up. Hold it there with the big knee. Body weight reaching forward. We're going to go lift and lower. Two, shoulders are drawing back and down here as you lift your leg behind you. Good. Five. Very nice. Keep the bottom leg supported. Two more. And last one. Very nice. Bring it down. Pick up your chair with bent knees. Bring it up. Bring it over to the other side. Bend your knees to place it down. Grab your towel. Have your towel on top of your chair. Good. And then let's go with the other knee on top. So your hand is holding the back of the chair. The other hand is holding the bottom of the chair. You're going to reach your leg up behind you. Lower your foot down. Reach your left arm back and keep your right leg forward. We go in and lift. Place. Kick. And down. Three. Lower. Extend and knee on the chair. Four leg up. Lower. Extend and down. Five. Lower. Extend. Beautiful work. 
six, that's it, excellent. Finding your control, finding the strength in the quad, in the glutes, all about the tone, all about that extra deep strength that is needed. Good, for leg height, for endurance while you're running and squatting. Very nice, last two, lift, lower, kick, last one, brave ragazze. Si, good, walk around, just move your little towel out the way. Same leg that was going up, stands onto the middle of your chair. Reach for the back of your chair as you inhale, and then we push up single leg lift or squat. Two, and lower, push down through your heel, three, and lower. Four, keep your knee reaching over your toe. Five, don't let it sway in and out, six. And also, try not to use too much momentum, seven. Use strength, good. And eight, take your hands, hold the back of the chair, bend your supporting knee, we breathe in. We go, lift and lower, two and lower, three and lower, four and lower, five, lower, six, good work, keep going, seven, keep that leg bent, eight, last two, nine, last one, ten, good. Slowly and gently bring yourself out of it. Perfect. Well done. Good. Turn yourself around. Sit in your chair. Open your feet as wide as your hips. From here, you're going to reach your arms forward. Push forward. Lift your bum up. Squeeze your glutes at the top. Bend your knees and hover just before you sit down. And then push yourself up and squeeze. And hover just before you sit down. Pause. And lift, three, squeeze the buttocks here, inhale to lower, exhale, push up, four, and inhale down, exhale, five, inhale, take it slow for now, six just for now, and lower, exhale, seven, and down into the squat, and eight, last two to go, exhale, nine, and lower, last one, Exhale, 10, take it down and hover your back just off the chair. Lift your chest up, pull your abs in, pull your ribs in, and drop those lovely lats down. Good, very nice. Take your hand, we go. Tap and forward, reach back and forward, reach back and forward, reach back. Beautiful, get the bums loud, down low. Inhale, reach. Beautiful, last two, get the bum down, reach, good, and one, and reach and bring your arms up, take a deep breath in, circle your arms around, take your hands, put them on the back of your chair, and sit your buttocks down. With your feet together, walk your feet forward, we go for tricep dips, bend, bend, and stretch, push out of the shoulders, bend, and bend, and stretch, make sure your toes are lining up. And more importantly, when you stretch your arms, let's push up and out of the shoulders. Bend, bend, and stretch. Singles, we go. Bend, stretch. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more. We go. And eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, good, one, and stretch it up. Gently walk your feet back, bring yourself into a standing position, and grab your towel. Pop your towel down onto the floor. Put your inside knee or the right knee on the towel, and lower your left elbow onto your chair. Right now, you're gonna extend your leg out and away from you. Reaching your hand behind your head, you're gonna lift this leg up. So we go, lift, bend, stretch, lower. Lift, bend, stretch, lower. And three, bend, extend, little side line lift. Four, bend, stretch, quick ones. We go, lift, bend, stretch, down. Two, breathe, three, can you draw your shoulders down? Four, looking good, don't give up, you've got four more to go. Lift, good, down, reach, bend, stretch, reach, last one coming up, 
Left bend, stretch and down. Spin yourself around. Bring your elbow down. Extend your leg and tuck your tailbone in. Hand behind the head, four so. We go left, bend, stretch and down. Parallel leg lift, bend. Can you tuck your bum in a little bit more? Good, lift, bend, stretch and down. Lift, bend, stretch. Quick ones, let's go. Lift, bend, stretch and down. Two, good work. Three, and four more, let's go. Reach, bend, stretch, down. Two, good. Three, come on, don't give up, give me that last one. Lift, bend, stretch and down. Spin yourself around, facing the back of your chair. Put your elbows down onto your chair, clasp your hands together. Step your right leg to the back, pull your hips up, pull your belly button up. And let's go into quite an easy plank position with your elbows underneath your shoulders. From here, you're going to take your right leg, you're going to step it forward into a lunge around the side of your chair, and then step your leg to the back. Left leg steps around and you push forward in your lunge. Beautiful. And then step it back. Right leg forward, and then step it back. Left leg forward, and step it back. Right leg forward, good. Make sure you really bring that left leg as far forward as you can. And bring it back, two more. Step forward, beautiful. And last one, step forward. And then step back, hold your plank position. Bend your knees, little jump out and in. Out, in, out, in, out, in. Good, keep your lats drawing down. Double out, double in. Out, out, in, in, out, out. Out, out, in, out, out, four more. We got four, three, two, good, one, and in. Walk your feet forward. Good work. Well done. Right, can be it. Placing your hands or your elbows onto your mat with your right arm out to the side and your left elbow down. Stretch your leg up onto the chair. Make sure that this knee is directly underneath you. And we're going to take the leg and lift the leg up. Lower the leg down in the chair. Tucking your back toe under. You're going to lift yourself up into a downward dog and bring it back down. So we lift the leg up, bring it down. Keep your foot on the chair, lift up downward dog. Push your body down. Let's go. Lift, lower, down dog, knee down. Lift, lower, three, and down. Lift, lower, four, and down. Lift, lower, down dog, very nice, five. Beautiful, so we're really getting work with the shoulder. Six, lower, reach, and down. Seven, lower, reach, good. We're gonna go to 10, eight, lower, reach up, and down. Nine, yes, you need that strength in your shoulder. Last one, 10, lower, hold it there. Keep it there. Push your body through your arm, you got this. Take your left leg, lift your leg up, off the chair. Circle the leg around to the back. Hold your leg up, let's pulse, we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring your leg down the neck. Beautiful work. Woo! Good job. Okay, I'm just gonna swap my chair over to the other side. If you'd like to do so, please change over. All right. So bring yourself down onto your right elbow, left arm onto the side, and then your legs up onto your chair. Take a lovely deep breath in. Make sure you're not too close to your chair. Sorry about that. And we go. Leg up, leg up, leg down. Lift up into your down dog, push your body through your arms and lower your knee back down. We go. Lift, lower, down dog, knee bends. Lift, lower, down dog, knee bends. Lift, lower, down dog. Make sure that that is connecting and that your head is lifted. You don't want your chin dropping down and in. Reach, good. Up to the pelvis, down with the knee. Reach, lower, 
Hug through the pelvis, down to the knee. Four more. You've got this. Yes, we want to turn our arms. We are ready for summer sleeves. Good. Lower. No more big arms. Good. Last one after this. We go leg up, lower, and hold it there. Push that right heel down as much as you can. Take your leg on the chair, lift it up. Circle your leg back. Little pulses. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And bring yourself down and in. Well done. Right. We're nearly at our halfway mark. Just want to make sure that you can see me properly with the lighting. All right. So, I want you to bring your towel and pop it back on top of the top of your chair. You're going to put the inside knee, so the one away from the back of your chair, on the chair. And you're going to take this leg and you're going to bring it around the back of your chest. So you're kneeling right up on your chair. You're working your core, your balance. Hold on. I hope this is not too hard for you, the back. And right from here, you're going to lean a little bit away from the chair. You're going to slowly stretch your leg. You're going to bend your knee in. Just find that stability. Stretch and bend. Stretch. Now notice, can you do less leaning? And more work in the quadricep. That's it. If you need to put another cushion under your hamstring, but okay, you can do that. Four, bend, grow tall here. Three, let's push our energy right up. Two, and in. The last one, good. We're gonna tap the front of your chair. You're gonna kick and in, reach it up. Down and kick and in, reach it up. And three. Extend, in, reach it up, good work, four, reach up, and I want you to get your thigh up in the sky, so we always go thigh up, leg extends, knee bends, arm reaches, lower down, thigh up, extend, knee bends, body up, and we go, two more, extend, and in, and reach, last one, take it down, extend your leg to the back, Circle your leg around. Bend your knee. Good. From there, tap your foot down to the floor. Keep holding your hands for the arm. Take that leg off your chair and stretch your leg over to the back. From there, we bend the knee. We bring the knee back onto the chair in a little cross. Lift your left leg to the back. Circle your leg around. Bring it over. Bend the knee. Reach your arm up. So we place the hand down in the chair. Extend, we call this a grand round de jambe to the back. Lower your foot, take the supporting knee off your chair, extend your leg to the back, and from there we bend the knee in and through, place it onto the top of your chair, reach your leg to the back in arabesque, do a big circle round, bending your knee, bringing your body up. Beautiful. We go down, stretch, circle round, work down. Arabesque kick, bring it in. Step the knee on, leg up. Circle round, foot in. Did you know you could do all this amazing stuff on the chair? Extend, next time you're ready to the party. You can be like, this is what I learned in COVID. <laughs> bring it in, place your knee on the chair, lift your leg up, circle round, bring your knee in, and reach it up. Last one for your foot one. Extend, circle round, Lower and then just reach, hold it there. We go down and up, little kicks and three and four and up and five and up, six and up, seven up, eight up, nine up, ten and up. Well done. Bend your knees, pick up your chair using your correct way of bending knees to move heavy things around. Very important. Now let's make sure we have this right. So, the inside knee, your left one is coming on. Grabbing your chair, just bring your leg around, pop it on top of your chair, and bring yourself up, find your stability. Make sure you're stable, please. Leaning slightly over and away, extend and bend. Squeeze the buttocks, get your tailbone underneath you as you stretch, bend. 
stretch. Now notice that you have to lean so far over to your right, or your left rather. Can you get a little bit more engagement through your and waistline? Beautiful. And extend and in. Last one. Extend and in. From here we go. Extend. Hand down in the chair. Reach your leg to the back behind you. Bring your leg around. Bend the knee. Lift your body up. Notice how different your sides feel. Extend your leg around. Bring your leg over. Bend your knee. Reach your arm up. Lower your arm down. Extend your leg. Circle your leg around. Bring your leg back. Lift your body up. Bend your knee. And we go down. And extend. Circle round to the back. Work your upper back here. Don't let your upper back collapse. Okay? When we start looking at technique, we start looking at these teeny tiny little details. Here, lift your opposite right and left shoulder up. Circle, use your spine. Start challenging yourself as we go for two more. Can you do this without dropping your body here? And you find a bit of trust within as you work your balance a little bit more. Good, good work. All right, from here, lower your arm, extend your leg, circle your leg around to the back, place your foot down on the floor in the cross position. Take the knee off the chair and reach your leg towards the back. Lift your chest up here, bend your knee, bringing it in, placing it on the chair, lift your leg up off the floor, circle your leg around, bend your knee, lift your upper body up away. Lower down, extend, circle round. Cross your foot, take your knee off your chair, extend, bring your knee in, place your knee on top of your chair, lift your leg up, do a lovely circle, let go of your hand, oops, getting the plant in over there, and you go, extend, hand to chair, big circle round, cross your leg over, bring your knee in, extend your leg to the back, go lift your chest, bring your knee back in, beautiful work, pop it on the top of the chair, leg goes around, Circle, bend the knee. We call this your adage. Your adage is the slow, controlled movement that you do when you're working into the stabilizing muscles, when you want to work height of your leg, you want to work strength, endurance. Beautiful. Place your hand down, extend, circle around, lower the foot. Now extend your leg to the back. Lift your chest up, shoulders down. We go. Down, kick. Two, kick. Three, kick. Four, and five, six, seven, and eight. Do two more. Nine, and ten. Well done. Gently and slowly, take your towel. This is just over your halfway mark. Dab yourself down. And please have a little sip of water. Beautiful work, well done. Right, so from here, you're going to take your chair, turn it around so that you're working with the back of your chair as what we call your ballet bar. I want you to stand with your feet in a turned out first position. And I want you from here to rise and lower on your toes, keeping your tailbone underneath you. We go. Rise, lower, two, and three. Imagine you're balancing a glass of water on your head. Five, six, squeeze your buttocks. Seven, don't lean back. Eight, last two. Nine, last one. Hold it up there. We go bend, stretch. Stay up on your three quarter point, like that. Try to squeeze those heels together. Working into those inner thighs, imagining you crushing like a, a little peanut or a walnut between those strong inner thighs of yours. Crushing, crushing. That's it. And four, and three, and two. You're going to stay in the bend position. One, take your right leg, step it back, bring it in. Left leg back, bring it in. Right leg back, bring it in. Left leg back, we're going to add two pulses. We go back, pulse, pulse, and in. Left, pulse, pulse, and in. While you're doing this, your knees are turned out. 
but your hips are square to the front of your chair. Back, bend, bend and in. Left, bend, bend and in. Two more, back, bend, bend and in. Left, bend, bend and in. From here, take your right arm off, scoot your bum to the right, to the left, to the right, to the left. Keep your knees bent and left and right and left and right and left, right and left and right. Quick ones, we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, take it down, down, two, up, two, down, two, up, two, down, two, up, two, down, two, up, two more, down, two, up, two, last one, good, and gently stretch your legs, step to the right, we flatten the feet, bend the knees, bring it up, to the left, bend your knees, bring it up, we go side, and bend, and up, out and bend, good, keep your tailbone in, let's go, fast ones, out, in, two, in, three, in, four, in, five, six, elbow up, seven, eight, nine, and ten, good, bring it in, lower your heels down, JB step backwards, in a parallel position, push your body through your arms, Get a lovely deep stretch in your hamstrings. Take a deep breath in and as you exhale, release. Good, two more breaths. The last breath, inhale. And then from here, you're going to bend your knees. You're going to lower your bum. You're going to gently control your knees down towards the mat. You're going to bring your body up. You're going to do a little back bend here. Bring your body up. Push your bum down, push your weight back in your heels, and then stretch the back of your knees. If you want your cushion, have it under your knees or your towel. So we go lower the knees with control, down to your mat. Bring yourself up, go into a back bend, squeeze your glutes. Bring your body up, lower your bum down to your heels, use your thighs to push up, and lift all the way up, you inhale. Lower your knees down, control them, Use your lats, pelvis up, back bend, body up, bring your pelvis down to your heels, straighten your legs, and push, good work. Three more, lower with control, knees down, lift your chest, back bend, bring your body up, lower your bum down, stretch your legs as you roll over your feet, good work. Two more, knees down, Lower your knees to your tail, lift your chest up, back bend. Bring your body up and push your bum down. Well done. And stretch. Woo! Ripple up through your spine. Good work. All right. So, nothing like a little bit of booty work. You're going to bend your knees, put your forearms onto your back of your chair. And we're going to stretch your right leg out to the side. We go lift, lower, lift, close it in. Left leg, lift, lower. Now your supporting leg stays bent. So you're doing two kicks to the right, keeping your supporting leg bent. Close it in. Two kicks to the left. Good. Close it in. Two kicks to the right. Lift and lower. Lift your chest up. I don't want to see those round postures. I want you to lift your chest up and be proud that you've got this beautiful spine that's strong and that you can do all of this fabulous work to the back. We go back, tap, back, lower, lift, tap, good, close it in, right leg, right, tap, lift, lower, lift, tap, good, to the side, right, lower, lift, left leg to the back. We go left, back, lift, left leg to the side. Side, lower, lift, close it in, right leg to the back. So you're doing two to the right, to the side, up, tap, up, now left leg to the back, straight back, left leg, tap, left leg to the side now. Up, tap, good, right leg to the back, lift, Tap, lift, and in. Stretch your legs. 
Bend your legs. And JV from here, put your hands on the back of the chair. Take your left leg, cross the ground, and place your hands onto the floor, little pulses. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Mind your chair over here, just be aware. You're gonna take your front leg, you're gonna reach it out to the side of the back, and then you're gonna step it back across. Two pulses. One, two, kick, and cross. One, two, kick, and cross. One, two, kick, and cross. One, two, quick, quick, <laughs> down. Good, and kick, bring it across. Bend, bend, extend, and cross. Two more. Bend, draw your shoulders down. Persevere, like a little bit of endurance. That's it. Extend, and cross, and gently bring your spine up. Woo, all of that. <laughs> Take a lovely deep breath in. We're gonna make sure that we do it on the other side. So crossing your right foot behind you, place your hands on the mat. Let's pulse for eight. Eight, seven, six, good work. Five, four, three, two, one. To reach your front leg to the back, kick. Bring it across, back to curtsy. And pulse for two, we go, kick and cross. Oh, sorry. One, two, kick and cross. We go. One, two, kick and cross. Three, shoulders down. Kick and cross. Your bottom leg is extending, your back leg is you kick and cross. Four more. Down, down. Extend and cross. Three more. Bend and bend. Extend and cross. Two more. Bend, bend. Extend and cross, last one, bend, bend, extend, and yes, roll up through your spine. Woo, I think my bum's gone up. <laughs> well done. Take your chair, flip it round, make sure you do that properly so you don't hurt your back. Come bring yourself down into a kneeling position. Good work. Put your elbows onto your mat on the cushioning, and you're gonna take your left foot and pop it on the back of your chair. Make sure we just make your necessary adjustments. But what's really important here is when you tuck your toe under, that you're not pushing back, that the chair lifts and slips away from you. You want your pressure directly in the middle of your chair on top. You wanna to pick your rib cage up, your tummy muscles up, and then pick your right leg up to join your left leg. You're pulling up and in into your abdominals, your lats are drawing down. Feel that you're pushing the floor away from you. Squeeze your tush. Make sure you're in a straight line. Looking down towards your feet. <sighs> Holding it there. Keep breathing. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, to slowly control your right knee down and control and left knee and just have a little breather, a little breathing moment. Well done. Good. Okay. The beads of sweat are starting to drip. This is always a good sign. When we hit our 45 minutes of the class, we hit our fat burning zone. So I want you to dig deep now. For those of you who know how to pack and can pack, you're going to add a pack to your plank. Otherwise, I ask that you just hold it. And if you find the top of the chair too difficult, put your feet on the floor and do a normal plank with a pack. Okay, there's always the floor option. Bringing your elbows down, clasping your hands together. Remember, your foot is on top of the middle of your chair. Breathing in. Lift your other leg up and take a lovely breath in, making sure that your chair doesn't move. We go, exhale, lift, pack up and bring it down and exhale pack up two make sure your chair's not moving otherwise put your chair up against the wall three and look exhale four and look exhale five pelvis high low exhale six bring it down listen to your body if you need to stop stop seven otherwise push through that it will be strong eight and good last two Nine, and last one, and ten, 
Bring it in, lower your right knee, lower your left knee. Well done, good challenge. Lovely work, you're gonna come down onto your side. This exercise started off as my worst exercise. I found it so difficult when I first started this chair class. And now as we're going on and on, I'm feeling so much stronger and I hope you are too. So bring your elbow directly underneath your shoulder. Lift this leg on top of your chin. If you need to put your towel there, please do for your ankle. Your bottom leg is extended in line with your body and you're gonna lift the pelvis up off the mat to be breathe in. Lift your pelvis up off your mat. And if you feel comfortable to extend your arm, squeeze your buttocks, push your pubic bone forward and hold while you breathe. Good. Inhale. Looking good, squeeze the buttocks. Try to get your bum in line with your leg. You're going to lift the bottom leg up. We go up and down. Two and down. Three and down. Good work. Four. Four more. We go. Five and six. Seven, squeeze the buttocks. Eight, good and lower. Beautiful work. Yes. Let's swing around to the other side. It's always happened. Place your elbow onto the mat. Foot up on the chair, bottom leg extended. Squeeze your bum forward. Make sure that your hips are facing forward as we breathe in. Lift yourself up and reach your arm up. Now remember your chest wants to lift. Your body's lifting as high as you can. You're really lifting up out, out of that bottom waistline. And four, three, two, we lift. Up and lower. Two and lower. Three, lower. Four, keep going. Five and six and seven. Last one. Hold it eight and release down. Well done. Woo! All right, good work. So coming onto your backs, hooking your ankles and your feet around your chair. You want to start off your hands, reaching up onto the chair, take a deep breath in. We roll down, 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 up and up. Two, down, lift and tap. Three, down, lift and tap. And I want you to take it all the way. With your head, you're keeping your chin tucked in and you're working into those abdominals. You're squeezing in with your ankles on the chin to help you stabilize and to assist you while you're building the strength. We go. That's it. Lift. Four more. You got this. That's it. Lift. If your hand head is getting sore, you can pop one hand behind your head. Two more. Down. Lift. Last one. Good. Down, lift, and pause. Take a little breather. Stretch your legs underneath you. Disclaimer, disclaimer. Okay, you're gonna pick up your chair. Tilt it. Please make sure the back of the chair isn't hitting you. And if your chair is too heavy, please, rather no chair. From here, we're gonna take the chair, bring it over our head, lifting up out of your spine. You're gonna push the chair up. Stretch, stretch, bend, Bend, exhale, push, up, bend. So this is actually very similar to the feeling that you would get when you're doing a head stack or a hand stack. Okay, working the same shoulder muscles, working into the traps. That's it. Stretch, stretch, two more, let's go. Exhale, up, up, bend, bend. Last one, lift. Now be aware of your spine, bend your knees if you need to. Control your chair down. Well done, excellent work. Okay, feet up on top of your chair. I want your fingertips facing out. You can do this on your elbows if you want to. Your knees are gonna stay bent. Take a lovely inhale breath and push up and out of your shoulders as you roll them back. If you just wanna hold this position, you can. Otherwise, you're gonna lift your pelvis up and then we're gonna bring the pelvis back down. So your pelvis is gonna lift straight up Squeeze the buttocks and then lower and release. Exhale, lift and up, lower and release. Exhale, lift and up and lower and release. Make sure that your chair isn't moving. Make sure that you're aware 
of how much strength and flexibility you have here. Have here. Does your body tends to get a little bit tired? We go three more. <laughs> Inhale down. Two more. Push. Lift. Lower. Good. Lift and hold it there. Four. Three. Two. And bring it down slowly. And well done. Beautiful. Slide your buttocks forward. Get your calves over the top of the chair. Interlace your hands behind the back of your head. Lift your elbows up. We breathe in. Chest lift up. Let's go. Up and down. Two and down. Three. Good. Four. Twist to the right. Right. Lower. Center. Lower. Left. Lower. Center to the right. Right. Lower. Center. Keep your head heavy in your hands and feel that your chest lift is coming from your rib cage. We don't want to feel your chest lift coming from your neck. Your head is heavy in the back of your hands. We go right, low, center, low, lift, lower, center. Good, four more. Right, low, center, and lift, lower, center, and right, lower, center, and lift, lower, center. Two more. Right, good. Keep the neutral pelvis. Feel the heaviness through your pelvis as you try to pull in your hips. Last set, lower, center, and lift, lower, center, well done. Easy peasy, good work. Bring yourself all the way up. Good work, from here, bring our hands directly underneath our bodies. Turn your legs out, walk your feet forward so your feet are under your hips. Take a deep breath in with your shoulders drawing down. We go bend the knees in a wide PA, bring the body up and stretch the knees, tilt the body over. So we call this grand PA, you're looking like this, and then you bring in your body up and over. We go down and exhale up. And let's actually do this. So twist your body on the diagonal. One hand on the chair, one arm reaching four backwards. Bend your knee, bring your arm above your head, tuck your back in, take your arm back and stretch. We go bend, arm up, arm goes back and extend. Bend, arm reaches up and lower, reach it down and back. One more, bring it up and then lift and go gently navigate over to the other side. Reach your arm back, we go. Bend, take your arm up, lower, reach your arm back. Bend, take your arm up, lower, extend back. Bend, arm up, lower, and extend back. We do three more. Try to squeeze your glutes underneath you, get your tailbone underneath you. Two more, and reach. Good, and last one, and reach. Well done. Pick up your chair. We got one more exercise to do. Place your chair this way, facing moi, and sit with your back at the front of your chair. Holding your hands around the bottom, cross your right ankle over, I mean your left ankle over your right leg. Put your hands like under your thighs and then pick your pelvis up off the chair. So you're really pushing up and out. From here, you're gonna kick your leg to the side and in. Side and in. Three and in. Get that thigh high. Good. Five. Six. Seven. Stretch the knee all the way. And eight. Bring it in. Lower the foot. Take the other leg. Cross it over. We go. Reach and in. Two. And in, three, in, four, last four for the day, four, yes, three, you've done it, two, and one, and in, and pop it down, bravi ragazze, good work, hold around your chair, let's do a couple of stretches, please finish off with your stretches, tilt your ear over to your shoulder, hold under the chair, this you can do at your desk, Circle your chin around, chin to breastbone, and left ear to left shoulder. The more you hold under the chair, the better that traction will be 
in your neck. Inhale and lung exhale, round, chin to chest. Pull over to the side, breathe in. Just releasing all that tension, all that tightness. Sitting at the front of your chair, interlace your hands behind the back of your head. We breathe in. Exhale, arch your body over and forward, drop your head down between your knees and tuck your bum in as you roll back up through your vertebra one at a time. There you go, exhale down, two, three, four, and roll up, six, seven, eight, reverse, in, two, your head between the knees, lift your head up, arch your back as you bring your body up. Good, contract, round your spine, lower down, and bring your body up, keep your body there, in a side bend to the right. We go side bend and center to the left. Side bend and center to the right. Keep your sit bones anchored in your chair. So in your side bend, you're not lifting the opposite hip. Good. We go over and lift. Slow and steady. Last one. Over. And lift. Take your right ankle, cross it over your left knee. With a flat back, we inhale and then lean forward as you push down into your knee and extend through your spine to get that really delicious stretch in the buttocks. If you're flexible, bring your elbows or forearms down and that will just increase the stretch. So I like to work this class in a way that we do a lot of circumductions and circular movements. So we're working a little bit more three-dimensional instead of just focusing on one muscle group. Gently bring your body up, uncross and cross the other leg over. And with the flat back, lean forward, pushing that knee down. Just becoming aware of which side is tighter for you. Yes, and stretch it out. Find your breath. And exhale. Now we inhale. And exhale. I love that you can do so much with the chair. <laughs> Gently bring yourself all the way up. Okay, take your hand in the inside of your foot and you're going to slowly stretch your leg out to the side, holding underneath the chair for a lovely deep stretch. And we hold it there. I want you to lift up and out of your spine. Feel that energy right up through the crown of your head. Beautiful. Take a lovely inhale breath, and then gently bring the leg in, cross your right leg over, grab on the inside of your foot, hold in the chain, and extend your leg to the side. Lift up and out of your lower back as you hold it there. Good. Gently bring your leg in. Now you're going to twist over to your left. You're going to slide your leg to the back, and we're going to go into a lunge. Make sure this heel is directly under your knee. We pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Hold it there. Bend your knee and stretch your knee. Bend your knee and extend your knee. And bend your knee and extend your knee. Last one. Bend your knee. Beautiful. Extend from there. Slide the foot in. Do a little shuffle over, grab your chair, and slide your leg back, give it back into the lunge. We pulse, and eight, seven, opening through the hip flexor, five, four, three, two, we go. Bend, extend, two, extend, good work, three, four, this is the last thing, five, and six, and seven, Good, and eight, well done. Gently stretch, come all the way here, parallel feet, hands onto the floor, drop your body down, breathe in, and breathe out. Inhale, bend your knees, wiggle your feet towards each other as they come all the way in. Keeping your knees bent slowly, restack your spine as you roll back up. Five, four, three, two, one. Well done.